friends, welcome to Easy and Home Style Cooking. I'm Mrs. Ragini. Today, I'm going to share a Tothyo recipe. And that too, Tothyos, we are going to stuff it with nice kidney beans and some salsa. I have already showed you how to make Tothyos. So today, we are going to just learn the simple stuffing. So dear friends, let's start how to make it. First, the salsa. I'm taking some finely chopped garlic. I keep telling, you know, if you are making totios, try to make couple of them and you can store it in refrigerator and whenever you want to have it, just remove it and warm it up and you can stuff different varieties of stuffings. So today basic variety and in this we are going to add some green chilies also for nice spiciness. You know whichever style your taste buds are, you can just make it in that way and finely chopped onions, tomatoes finely chopped and coriander finely chopped and some cumin powder you know little bit indian style and some salt mix it once we are going to squeeze in some lime juice if you want you can add some vinegar also half lime should be good enough just mix it once more dear friends here i have the kidney beans you can just keep some of the rajma boiled rajma and keep aside and you can make an excellent salsa so this i did the same way i just boiled it and I used couple of them for the rajma and couple of them I am using for this totio stuffing. So here I have the kidney beans. See, this is so nice and soft. I love like this. So you can just cook it till this is little bit soft. And we are going to just check our salsa first, the spiciness and everything. Mm, this is nice. You can just have it just like this also. So different salsa is super tasty very very simple to make it you can just make it instantly also and we are going to add this boiled kidney beans and also some tomato ketchup this is optional if you want you can add otherwise you can skip also and mix it again you know kids love tomato ketchup so if you're making for kids what i suggest is add little bit extra so that they will lick everything so this is ready to go into our tokyos and here I have little bit sour cream and good amount of cheese. So we are going to stuff it and we are going to put some sour cream and cheese. So dear friends, here our salsa is ready and here I have the totio ready. I kept it ready. See, nice. Whenever you are making your totios, try to cook it light so that when you want to use it again, you can just reheat it and you can make an excellent totios. You know why to get the store bought dear friends? This is a very very simplest way to make it. You can make it freshly. You know instead of chapatis, sometime you can just try this. This will become little bit soft once it is slightly heated. So friends here you can see it's slightly warmed. It's nice puffing up. Always make thin. Then you will you know like to have it. My husband says thin is good. If you want thin, you can make it thin or otherwise thick also. So first we are going to spread some cream cheese. If you don't have cream cheese, what I suggest is take nice hung yogurt and you can use this hung yogurt instead of cream cheese. So just spread it nicely. You can use whichever sauces you want to spread till the edges, you know dear friends. We want each and every bite to have this cream cheese. Each and every bite we want this sour cream. So this is ready and now we are going to take some lettuce. If you want you can add any vegetables dear friends. I love to add lot of vegetables. This is the best way to feed your family. So just spread your lettuce and also some capsicum that is bell pepper. You can use colors some green and red. Even you can use tomatoes. Now we are going to put our kidney bean salsa. If you want you can put lot of it dear friends and you can put little bit of rice also or you can you know serve it in a bowl also the rice and last you can add some gokomole and cheese but here in India it's very difficult to get avocados in Hyderabad. I'm not using gokomole so just using some cheese and this is all ready. Close the edges and you know either way you can just fold this little bit tight and this is all ready just wrap it up and put it in a tiffin box kids or even you if you're working you can just have this for lunch 
or even morning breakfast isn't it very simple dear friends i'm just going to cut this and we can have it nicely see if you want you can put little bit of rice mm. this is a full full meal dear friend these are very very simple to make it and we need not use any store-bought ingredients every ingredient we have it in our home dear friends try to make fresh food so that your family will be nice and healthy like us so dear friends i hope you enjoyed this simple stuffed tortillas if you like it make it and also share it with your friends so that